It's your boy D Wallace here and today I'm going to Pflugerville to check out these couple shops and I'm going to Liberty Hill to go to a truck dealership been looking at a Duramax for these past couple weeks I hope y'all like this video and let's get right to it I'm a man you go crazy for the cash Perfect. Green Lamborghini paper tags Just checked out Flugerville signs over here in Flugerville. Um, got a guy that I'm gonna I'm gonna do my wrap on my grill. Um, does really really good wrapping, so I'm gonna go ahead and take my wrap over here. Um, and y'all let me know. Should I paint? Should I paint my mirrors or wrap my wrap my mirrors? Y'all leave a comment on below in the video. So what should I do? Wrap or paint my mirrors? You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm trying to color match everything for Texas Heat Wave. And that's another thing. I did get a spot at Texas Heat Wave with my boys from AI Performance Off-Road. As you can tell, there's a little sticker right there. Yep. Um, I've been helping them out. I'm, I know on my couple of videos a while back that I did a video at their at a meet over there but it's gonna look good at texas heat wave i hope i get everything color matched by heat wave you know what i'm saying now on our way to liberty hill to go check out this duramax I'm over here at American Truck Source in Liberty Hill, Texas. I've been told by a couple people that this is supposed to be like a good dealership, but so I'm gonna see how the inventories look like and all that. Um, I'm gonna check out this Darmax that I've been looking at the past couple of weeks. Oh, this 7.3's got a 2012 Lariat C interior swap on it. This thing's got 160,000 miles on it. You know what I'm saying? Very, very clean for a 7.3. Ooh, 6.7. So this Platinum, like I said on all my videos, I love the Platinums on the F-250s. This one's got the black seats with the sunroof on it. Like, if I had the money, I would trade my truck in and get this sucker right here. Like, look at this. Can't tell, but black seats sunroof on top you know what i'm saying platinum you know what i'm saying and also y'all leave a comment on below in the video that what should i do should i for my next truck should i get a platinum or find a rare 73 as low miles as as not decked out like this one 
but find like a stock 7.3 with low miles build it like i did to my 6.0 and do it from there so like i said y'all vote platinum or 7.3 guy inside um, I'm gonna try to get appraised for how much my trade-in is for my 6.0 um, I saw one of my buddies that I subscribe on YouTube um, it's Diego Perez but his Instagram is Foxy 6.7 I think I'll leave it I'll leave his Instagram on the video right here but yeah uh, I don't know about that one but anyways um, I'm waiting on him, see how much my trading value is from there. So I'll let y'all know on that. Alright, so so I got the paper to the praise for my 6-0. Alright, so the guy was really, really honest to me. Um she said the best right to do is to sell it outright on Craigslist or on Kogaroos or whatever. But I do not have the paper because it's embarrassing. I told him, hell no. All right, it's ten thousand dollars for my trading value. Terrible. I mean, uh, it's. I, I mean, it's insane. I mean, with that, I would have been all right. But I would have got me that 7.3 that's right there on the corner right there. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, $10,000. Um, I'm not going to trade in my truck in for that price. I mean, if I'm looking at 15 or 17, yes, I would do it. But 10, hell no. All right, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope y'all like this video. Um, I know in this video, I didn't... Put the Duramax on there because they want a high price on it. So, like I said to my trading value, hell no. Like, I'm not doing that. So, leave a comment on below on what what should I get, either a seven three or a six seven. On the six sevens, it has to be either a Platy or a King Ranch. Um. But I already know the stuff I wanted to do for either the 7.3 or the 6.7, like mods and then, like, and the body stuff and all that. And also, leave a comment below as well for should I do a 6-inch lift or should I do a leveling kit on my 6.0. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm trying to go big or go home when it comes to LST next year. And I'm really excited for Texas Heat Wave. Like, I'm really, really excited and for LST for next year. Y'all stay tuned on that. And also, make sure to follow the media. Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. You know what I'm saying? And I'm out. Peace. I'm a man go crazy for the cash. Green Lamborghini paper tag.